As a kid, I used to always be very athletic, and when I was a little kid, I had some, into uh, the first grade, I had already tried a whole bunch of sports. Like I, I did tennis, ballet, judo, soccer, basketball, horse riding. What got me into basketball was the fact that soccer, which was my primary sport back then, <laughs> was not that popular for girls in, in Greece. And basketball was, it had more girls involved into it. So I started playing, I immediately fell in love with the game. I still remember the first time that I scored a three. It was through a win assist. We were down six, I think, or six or five points, and I get the ball in the last seconds before, right before the, the bell rang. And I shoot it, I make it, and everybody goes crazy, but I didn't know anything about basketball like that, about the rules. And so I said, I just made up a story saying, like, since everybody was on the key, and I made a three, and we got the ball back, we got a rebound, which, which counts for four points, so we win the game. <laughs> everybody was cheering for my team, the other boys were like, oh no, <laughs> let's just go back to class. <laughs> first came here in the States, the term leadership incorporated more things that I didn't think I had back then. So one of them was being more verbal, and more expressive, and more outgoing. Before I came here I was very quiet, I, I was still still a leader by example, but even that I did not know that about myself. And my mom kept trying to remind me that I've always been a leader my whole life. I used to always have my friends or my teammates following me. But still, I, I didn't think that that was enough to be a leader here in this team. They need you to be verbal. They need, need you to communicate to people to, to get everybody involved you know, on the same page. And that was hard for me because I was, I was coming from, from Greece and uh, English was not my first language. And I was quiet already. So it was not a part of who I was. And I had to think and I had to make the translation in my head and everything. And I had to first listen to see what other people say. What are, what are the right words to say? How is, what is the right approach? Just looking back, I never thought I'd be able to be a captain of this team. Outside of practice, um, I study most of the time. <laughs> I also have my brother here, and he's a PhD student, so every time I have some, some free time, I just go to his house and he comes over and we watch the NBA or the EuroLeague, whatever it is at that point where he's playing. I'm Penelope Pavlopoulou, go Cougs!